magnetic reversals. First, I want to start out with my compass here. So I have this compass, and the arrow on there always points north. And why does it do that? It's because Earth itself is like a giant magnet, has a magnetic field, and this little piece of metal, metal here recognizes that and points towards the north. Now, the magnetic north pole of Earth at times will sort of flip-flop where the north becomes south and the south becomes north. Now, it takes thousands of years, and it kind of happens randomly. We're not sure why. Um, but that gets recorded in the rock of the ocean floor, okay? So whatever the uh, direction of the north is, be it normal, we know today, or reversed, which is the opposite, that gets recorded in the rock on the ocean floor at the, the divergent plate boundaries, which is really cool. So this is sort of one way that it gets represented here with the arrows. I feel this is a little hard to show, but it shows how they go in opposite direction, the normal, normal versus re reverse polarity. Now, in this case, now they're showing it with different colors. So now the reversed is dark and the normal is this light gray. So basically what we see is we, if you were to uh, be able to get the polarity of the rocks, you see these stripes and these bands and they're different thicknesses because uh, how long it exists in one polarity or the other sort of is not consistent. And uh, what we see here on then this side of the mid-Atlantic ridge would be uh, a matching pattern, okay? And what I mean by that is like this layer and this layer, they formed at the same time. This layer, th this layer reversed the same thickness. Th this layer is supposed to match up. It's just not drawn that great. But this layer and this layer and this layer, these are the same. So they match up. They have, they have their same pattern on either side. This is one of the pieces of evidence. This is how we know that seafloor spreading is happening. So um, that's pretty cool. This is another one. I think this was a region's question where they gave you this. You actually draw the other one in, but it looked like that. So, like this, so this here, these represent these, this thin uh, area of normal polarity. They were both back here when they formed, so they match up. So, you see a similar pattern on both sides of the uh, any mid ocean ridge.